hello guys welcome to how to fix tech in this video guys we are going to fix the issue windows 11 setting is not working when you clicking on this option setting the setting options are not coming on your windows 11 pc or 10 so how to troubleshoot this issue so first of all guys we will troubleshoot this issue from the basic level so you need to right click on the task manager open the task manager here and once you open the task manager simply right click on the windows explorer and simply restart it so restart will refresh all the setting related to the windows setting as well and check if it fixed the issue or not if it is not fix your issue guys move on to the second method in the second method guys simply will repair our windows with some commands so we need to right click on the start menu not let you need to right click there okay and open the terminal as admin hit yes now we will re-register all the settings so these are the commands guys we have to copy the first command this will re-register all the app setting into the windows hit this command and once you executed this command you will see the windows like this and after executing this command check if it fixed the issue or not if not you can restart your system once and after that it should fix the issue if it doesn't fix the issue you can also hit this command now this will reinstall all the packages in the windows 11 and 10 hit enter this may take some time guys so if any red error are coming ignore them just leave it it will automatically update all the settings and once it is done it will automatically update it here so as you can see it is going to installing all the packages the previous command was for re-registration re of the settings and all the apps but this one is reinstalling all the packages ok my setting is working perfectly but I am just going to show you you can hit these commands without any hesitation these commands are safe this will not harm your computer so once these packages are installing in the background we can minimize this and we can move on to the third step ok in the third step run the cmd as admin hit yes ok and you need to hit these command guys this one is sfc space slash scan now sfc means system file checker this is the popular command to repair the windows corruption the second one is repairing disk image so it's now it's done you can see here you can also hit these command into here as well like this hit this command so this process will also take some time once it is completed 100% you need to copy and paste this command disk commands and you can hit copy and paste and hit enter so this is also restore your deployment imaging services and this will restore your windows setting I mean the corrupted image and once it is done you have to restart your system once the both command are executed and also above two commands are executed you have to restart the system and check if it fix the issue or not this will go like this if not sometime windows update can 
cause this issue as, as well corrupted so press window plus I button or you can look for check for update if you are able to do that from this account if you are able to do the windows update download all but if not we have to create the new account here so open the file explorer or we can press window plus R button together uh, let me open the file explorer uh, then you need to right click on the this PC and show more options manage we are basically creating the new admin accounts here accounts and groups users now right click new user just name it I'm giving it test full name test and password if you want to create the password and never okay create the account here once the account is created make a right click go to its properties and go to member of and you need to type for administrator Traitors and check names now it's added the underline hit ok apply you can see it's added into admin group so you can re-verify the setting here member of administrator and once this user is created just log off from the current user ok sign out from the current user and log in with the newly created user and check for update the setting from there and it should fix the issue so hope this helps you guys if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech